Learning is growth. Learning is a step forward. Learning is a commitment to always moving ahead. Uh, and I think that that is something that, I mean, I feel very passionate about. I think that when you think about learning in terms of growth, who doesn't want growth? You know, good things come from growth. Um, I mean, unless you see it on cheese, then generally speaking, uh, you know, you want to embrace growth. And I think that why shouldn't everybody embrace learning? So yeah, learning to me is all about growth and moving ahead and constantly evolving. Uh, when you think about the ability to learn and the ability to have that intellectual curiosity, that's where uh, an organization gets ahead. I mean, sure, if you have a solid strategy at the beginning, great. But today's uh, markets move so quickly that it's so incredibly important to be looking around and to look to see, well, what can we do differently? You know, what are the new uh, ways that we can evolve as an organization? Maybe there are new business units we should be investing in or new industries we should be going into. Uh, how else can we disrupt? That's really what learning is all about. It's fostering this internal innovation. I actually recently learned uh, about compartmentalizing things with respect to, uh, I don't even mean work versus uh, home life, uh, but actually work versus other work projects. You know, it's very important to be in the moment in any one particular thing that you're working on. Mm -hmm. And if you have something else, a major deadline coming up for something, uh, you know, entirely unrelated, you have to put on blinders and you have to say, okay, that's over there, and I'm not going to be addressing that right now. I'm going to be entirely in the moment, just like I am in this interview with you. That's a really good lesson for everybody, but where did you learn that lesson? You know, I actually learned that lesson, believe it or not, uh, at work. Uh, I had two different projects where the schedules were kind of colliding, and I said, well, I can bounce back and forth in between these two, uh, or I can be present in one moment and be as focused as possible, do as good of a job as possible, and then move on to the next as opposed to bouncing back and forth. They're essentially switching costs. The more you bounce in between, everybody thinks they're a terrific multitasker. Pretty much everybody is a, a very crappy one, if I can say that.